everyone and welcome back to Alan Wake. We it's getting good. Um, I'm Reptilia Reptile. If you are new here, welcome. If you are not, welcome back. Let's get back into this. Motherfucker. Where you at? No. The great old one. Filled by lightning in 1937. This is especially tall Rocky Mountain Douglas fir. I am not gonna try to pronounce that. It was over 200 years old. According to local legends, it stretched beyond the stars. After it fell, it was measured to be 66 meters tall. Nearly a record length. That's tall. I don't know where I'm supposed to be going. There's three. I am out of shotgun ammo. In the famous words of Bert Gummer, I am completely out of ammo. I'm probably missing some pages. Oh, you are shitting, right? Just gonna stay in here for a little bit. shotgun ammo. I don't want revolver ammo. I want shotgun ammo. What is this? Oh! That's just lovely. I turned the corner, afraid of what the flashlight's beam might reveal. Suddenly, a roughly painted symbol of a torch glowed in the light. Behind it, hidden by a rock, sat a battered metal trunk. It was here for a reason. Packed with supplies. Batteries, flares, ammo. Things you need to make it through the darkness of the night. I got Something cold. left behind by someone who knew what I knew. And more. Still have a jacket clean. Or at least a comfy one. I don't know what happened to my green one that I used to wear. What? Bear alert? The... The what? The tanks are filled with darkness. That's... lovely. Spooky, scary skeletons. The 
both had to, I shouldn't have triggered them. Not here. No, no, no. I have no room to fight anyone here. Oh, motherfucker. Where's that flare? Fuck you, motherfucker. Yeah. Like, yeah. Play game or fuck around and find out. This game is a game of a uh, fuck around and probably shit your pants. Booker. I was just coming up this way to see if there is anything of use. But it is not. Which way do I go? Not that way. What does it say? For your safety, set it on designated trail. Right. I'm staying where the lights are. Like it was done on purpose. Mm. What? The fuck? Oh, I don't like this. What is this? This tree ring was cut from the tree this ring was cut from started growing in 1846 the year the Oregon Treaty was signed other notable events marked on the rings 1853 Washington Territory was formed 1878 the wash the founding of Bright Falls Mining Co and the town itself 1889 Washington was granted statehood 1929 tree damaged in forest fire 1970, the Bright Falls Mining Co. closes doors after a volcanic eruption below Cauldron Lake. 1980, Mount St. Helen erupts. 1987, tree felled by a storm. Oh, is this that one tree that was over there? The big, big one? That's cool. That's pretty cool. But, uh, where am I supposed to go? Where am I supposed to be going? I am confused. Am I supposed to climb over this? I guess so. Hmm. Yeah, that was done on purpose. Agent Nightingale didn't want to be in Bright Falls. These little communities revolted him, and he didn't like the trees or the coffee. He now knew that impossible horrors lurked behind the storefronts and smiles. He desperately wanted to turn the car around and just drive until he passed out or ran out of road and booze. But he had a job to do. He had a rider to catch, at any cost. Oh, 
birdies scare me. That's a good flashlight. If my husband was over here, he would be saying, that flashlight is blah 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 lumens. Flashlights, kid stuff. The flares will keep the bastards away. No shit, but I only use them if need be necessary, motherfucker. Cause I don't get that many flares like you do. You can see them too? Hell, of course I see them. Come on, we gotta move. Why? <laughs> because that's the way the story goes. Yeah, but- Let's move! I lost my gun back there. Oh, I've got a gun. Just keep that light steady on him. It took a moment, but then I recognized him. He'd been on the ferry when I first arrived here with Alice. He knew my name. We were headed in the direction of Lover's Peak. There was no way this was a coincidence. He was the kidnapper. Come on, Wake. You better keep. Oh! Ah, oh, shit! stairs wake well use the flares from the emergency box to hold them off while i get these boards off mother give me the gun. fucker yeah. no can please are you kidding give me the gun no time for back talk oh, uh. oh, okay okay i know how to use the flare just let me open this open this open this get some flares get some flares just a little longer scare them off Get some light on those bastards! That'll keep them off us! Just a little longer! I almost got it! Well, hurry the fuck up, dude! Okay, it's open. Move it or lose it. Go! 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 I'm learning. You're on your own, bro. Where you at? Wait, where'd that one go? Get your ass up here! Oh, you feeling better now, Wake? All cozy and safe. Ooh, I'm gonna punch you in the fucking cods, dude. Better get ready. They'll be on us soon. Hey, motherfucker, you got a gun. This is it, Wake. The last stand. There's more flares here. Get ready. We fight them as long as they keep coming. Give me the goddamn gun! They're coming! That's not how this goes. Get with the program, Wake.
shit. Hyper focused, you guys. Let's cut the act now. Where's my wife? I knew you were gonna say that. I read it all before. You're a hell of a writer. Congratulations. You're gonna bring about something glorious and terrible once we get you some uh, proper editorial control. What the hell are you talking about? Where's Alice? I want the entire manuscript, or she's gonna suffer bad. You touch her all. <laughs> because he thought it held some magical power. But I had no manuscript to give him. I had to get back to Barry and figure out my next move. There's an arrow. Okay. Hmm. There's another manuscript page. On more than one occasion, Alice had tried to explain to me how it felt to be afraid of the dark. To her, darkness wasn't simply the absence of light, but something more tangible than that. It was something you could touch and feel. Worse than that, it was something with a mind of its own, something malicious and malign. For her, things changed when they were wrapped in darkness. They turned into something else, something foreign, and nothing was safe or innocent anymore. I'd never really understood what she meant until now. Oh, is he basing his book? Is all this, like, how she feels in the dark? Ooh, that would be a cool little twisty twist. Like, this is what she feels and everything in the dark. That'd be cool. There's like this one gnat that won't leave me alone, you guys. That's what I'm doing. That. I don't know where to go. That's a loud truck outside. Oh, oh, oh. Is that that guy? What is this? Oh! What the hell? Mother Fucker. Rusty had warned me about these traps. It hurt like hell. I was stuck. So don't step in the shiny. Which way am I supposed to go? I... What was that? Okay, that's a trap. I don't know where I'm supposed to go.
That's why you wear headphones when you play games, kids. Because you can hear the shit. I don't know where I'm supposed to be going. I am lost. And all sorts have turned around now. Sure okay, so I came from that way. Okay. So. There's another one of those damn bear traps. That hurt the good boy. Hunting rifle? Hmm, don't mind if I, yes. night had been one desperate situation after another. I was exhausted, and my body felt as though it had been chewed up and spat out. The flashlight was heavy in my hand, and each pull of the trigger sent a painful shock up my arm. But I was finally out of the woods, and things were looking up. That's when I heard the chainsaw. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, what? Chainsaw? Am I gonna have to fight somebody with a damn chainsaw now? Eh. I don't wanna. Am I 
supposed to drop down and go this way? I feel like that's a no, but I see something over here. So, whoa, did they pick up something? I had heard the plane fall. It made no sense. It was clear that it had just fallen here, but it was very old and obviously hadn't flown in decades. Looking at it sent a shiver down my spine. Can I go that way? It's not creepy. It's not creepy. What the actual fuck is going on? This game is a huge mind fuck. supposed to be doing with the plane thing. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. No, 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 no. Oops. Hmm. Okay, it just came from there. What is this? That just sounds fucking lovely. There's something over there.
about you run like a motherfucker, Alan Wake? Like one of my playthroughs that I have not talked too much in. <laughs> Mainly because I'm like so intrigued. I don't know what that does. Another manuscript page. <laughs> the logging site was a mess. The modular office had been pushed off the cliff. Deputy Thornton climbed up from the wreckage, excited, breathing hard from the exertion. Nobody there. It's weird. Don't you think that's weird? Bored, Mulligan let out a mighty snort. Hell, it's always weird, Thornton. Just a question of sorting out what kind of weird it is this time around. <laughs> this whole game is weird. It's weird, but it's good. I'm playing this one so that I can play Alan Wake 2 when it comes out. Yeah, boy! So, where am I supposed to be going? Kick? What am I kicking this for? Oh, to get across! That's... Jump! Ahaha! Another manuscript page. Do, 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 do. Hey, I almost got them all. 
When Barry saw the darkness attack the visitor center, it made him a believer. It's the men Barry. Al said oh, he shot, Barry. they hadn't been just locals on crank. Somehow the world had changed, like the channel had been switched without warning. You think you're watching a sitcom, and you're really watching a horror show. When the birds started attacking the cabin, Barry wasn't surprised, just terrified. The birdies attacked the cabin that Barry was in? Did I make that move? I don't know. I don't know what that's doing, but I guess we'll just keep doing it. I think when I died, I didn't get to keep that thermos that I had earlier. Makes me sad, but what are you gonna do, huh? Where am I supposed to go now? I'm supposed to jump out of a window? Where am I supposed to go? A row. Oh, there's a ladder over here. <laughs> I can't see. Ah! Oh. What was that? Oh, it was a little feather reflection. I don't know what that does, but, uh, yeah, I know. Oh, yay. The darkness. Shut up, a bitch! Where are you at? Oh, come on, work! The darkness was her. Where's her face? Were her. Can't even read. Okay, yeah, I got 13 ammo and some hunting rifle. Don't know why I'm not using that. Oh, I've only got two batteries. Oh, 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 that was me. There's a little kit thing over there. Is there any other stuff around here? I do not see any. Oh, let's do this, I guess, right? Make it through the woods. Am I not out of the woods yet? I got two more batteries. Which way do I go? That looks like it goes out of the woods. Or deeper in the woods. But the same goes for this. I don't know. Oh, I took a... Oh, oh, this is just a dead end. Okay. Well, that makes the decision a lot easier. On where to go. My tummy hurts. I ate too much food. What the fuck? Shit's getting harder. Says make it through the woods. I did. There's a there's a thingy up there. Oh, come on, no. I need some more ammo. <laughs> Can't 
campgrounds. That's that's out of the woods, right? Maybe. Oh, there goes a tree falling. I know, I know, like a deal. Zoning is a hazardous occupation. Oh, we have got, got to be shitting me. Yeah. Go back to sleep. Oh well. Stay out of sight. I'm on my way. Don't open the door. What am I, crazy? Stay hidden. I'll be there soon. Just make sure you keep the lights on. I still had to reach Barry at the cabin, but at least I was out of the woods. Okay, everyone, we're gonna leave this episode here. Um, so, I'll pick it up in the next episode. So, as always, if you liked this video, don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see all you guys in the next video. Bye!